Millions of people are on the internet every day. And did you know that companies that collect your information without you noticing, hackers wait to steal your account, sites that track your movements without you noticing, people who want to infect your computer with viruses, and even government are listening to you? Let's see what kind of hack we present to the other part while browsing the internet together. When we look at the cyber tracking, there are software such as digital footprints, location, web history, cookies, and advertisement. Look at the cyber security section. Hacking, identity thief, cyber fraud, malware, ransomware. How can we protect ourselves and surf anonymously on the internet? Is there a solution? Yes, of course, there are tales. What is tales? Tales or the amazing incognito life system is a security focused Debian-based Linux distribution is aims at privacy and anonymity. It forces all the inbound and outbound connection to be made through Tor and Blog non-anonymous connections. The system is designed to boot from live DVD or live USB and leaves no digital traces on the machine unless specifically request. Tails was an important tool they used in their work with national security agent whistleblower Edward Snowden. We can keep our computer safe anywhere. To use Tails instead it's shutting down the computer and starting it on Windows, Mac OS or Linux. We can start using your Tails USB stick quickly and to start using it. You don't have to worry that the computer infected because tail works independently from other operation system and never uses the hard disk. However, tails cannot always protect you. If you install it from an infected computer or use it in a computer with malicious hardware such as Keylogger. They always start from the same clean state and when you close tail everything you do automatically lost. Almost anything you do without tails can leave traces on the computer, website you visit even in incognito mode, files you open even if you delete them, password even if you see a password manager, all the device and Wi-Fi networks you see. Conversely, Tails never writes anything to the hard disk and only runs from the computer memory. When you close Tails, all the possible traces are deleted, and the memory is the completed wipe. You can save some of your files and configuration is encrypted. Persistent storage on a USB stick, your document, browser bookmarks, email, and even some additional software. Persistent storage is optional and you always decide what is permanent. Tails includes several applications for working on sensitive documents and communicating securely. All apps are ready to use and configured with security defaults to avoid errors. Tor Browser with you block, a secure browser and an ad blocker. Thunderbird for encrypt emails. KeyPassXC to create and store strong password. LibreOffice and Office Suite. UnionShare for sharing files over Tor and more. This is how normal internet works. When you search for something on your computer, the first step goes to the internet service provider. From there it connects directly to the server you want to connect to the site. Everything you do on the internet from tail goes through the Tor network. Tor encrypts and anonymizes your connection by passing it through three delays. Relays are server operated by different people and organizations around the world. The single relay never know but where the encrypted connection is coming from and where it is going to. Tor has more than 6000 relay. Organizations running Tor relays include university like the MIT. The huge diversity of people and organizations running Tor relays make it more security and more sustainable. For prevent someone watching your internet connection from learning what you are doing on the internet. You can avoid censorship because it is impossible for a sensor to know which websites you are visiting. If connecting to Tor is blocked or dangerous to use from where you are. For example, in some country with heavy censorship, you can use bridge to hide that you are connected to the Tor network. Tor also provides the websites that you are visiting from learning world. 
and who you are unless you tell them. You can visit website anonymously or change your identity. Online trackers and advertisers won't be able to follow you around from one website to another anymore. All the code of our software is public to allow independent security research to verify that Tails really works the way it should. Tail has an idea. No one should have to pay to be safe while using a computer. Now, let's quickly set up together. Installing Tails is very simple. We can install it in just three steps. Let's get started. First, let's go to our site and click Get Tails from here. From which operation system we will install Tails? Let's choose it and continue. Don't forget, you can download different download files as you want here. Click here and let's get started. First, let's download our image file. Let's verify for security purposes. If the process is finished, let's go to the next step to create the Tails installation disk. We need at least 8 GB flash disk. Add your program and finally Tails image. Let's run program and define the image file we download from here. Let's choose our flash disk and flash. Now our tail is ready. The next step is to plug the flash into the computer. Run the computer again and enable the computer to boot via USB. If you want detailed information, I leave the link below. You can check it from there. Today we learned what tail is, how it works, where it is used, how to install it. See you in the next video. Take care of yourself.